guys welcome back to my channel so for today i'm going to be recreating this drawing that my son did and turning it into a face paint i did get this idea from one of my friends over on instagram i'll link all of her stuff down below so you can go check her out so this is the drawing that he started out with and i'm just going to start by using a contour pencil and just sketching in where all of my little markings i guess are going to be so using this, I'm just sketching in the design and then using my finger to kind of blend it out. This is going to act as the shadow underneath all of the other stuff that I'm going to be layering on top afterwards. And then going in with the Tarte Shape Tape, I'm just going to be applying that to my lids under my eyes and then tapping that out with my finger. And then going into this palette right here, I'm going to use this shimmery red shade and take that onto a fluffy brush into my crease. And then with this black eyeshadow, I'm just going to be putting that into the outer corner of my lid and darkening up that crease. And then going back in with that tart shape tape, I'm just going to be cutting my crease. And going in with this Jeffree Star palette, I'm going to use this shimmery shade and just apply that to the inner half. And then using this red shimmer shade from that same palette, I'm just going to tap that onto the outer portion to kind of blend it. Next, I'm just going to line my upper and lower water lines and then create a wing. And then going in with this liquid liner, I'm just going to be creating all of the cracks. And then with a yellow body paint, this one's from Blue Squid Pro, I'm just going to apply that into the center of that circle and then tap it out with my finger kind of to create a glow behind everything else. I'm also going to do the same thing with the cracks. I'm just going to layer the yellow on top and then pat it out with my finger. For all of the little skin falling off pieces and cuts, I'm going in with this dark red body paint from Global Body Art and I'm just filling those in. I'm also going to be using this on the cuts around my mouth as well. And then going in with some brown body paint, this one's from Blue Squid, I'm just going to fill in that inverted cross. And then I did originally draw in that circle on my forehead with that same brown body paint, but then I decided that I wanted to make it darker. So I went in with a black cream makeup, but I'm just sketching all of that in. And then going in with a black eyeshadow, I'm just going to be taking this and shading around all of the edges of the cross. I'm also going to be taking it around all of the cuts. And then on a fluffy brush, I'm just going to be using it to create a deeper shadow around all of those things. And then doing the same thing to the pentagram on my forehead. And then going in with a black body paint, I'm just going to make the lines on those cracks a little bit darker. And deepen up around the cuts. Next, I'm going in with a contour shade that's kind of red toned, and I'm just taking that and kind of making irritation around those cuts. I'm also going to create some irritation around the cracks as well. And with that same dark red body paint, I'm just going to be using this and just watering down my brush a lot and kind of tapping it on and then using my finger to smear it out and just kind of layering it up. I'm also going to be creating some drips on my shoulders. For this, I'm just layering on the red body paint and then using a really watered down brush and letting it drip down naturally. And then I went ahead and filled in my brows. Then to make that star on my forehead a little more metallic, I'm going in with this Aurora Lights palette and I'm going in with this like gray to shade around the star. And then finally, I'm just adding some squirt blood. This one's from Bloody Mary makeup and that's it i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please let me know in the comments below see you next time bye